Capricorn and welcome to your weekly forecast. Now let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Alright. Oh, you'll be traveling or thinking about traveling. Uh, some other issues or issues about your mother. And a fire sign that's been lying in front of your face. Alright. Now Capricorn, you... It's like you're going to be making a new game plan this week that is related to your work and how you can, you know, do things, perform things, you know, formulate things. It's like you will be putting your concentration, your head and your, you know, your energy into beautifying your work or to make things work. And you want to present this to, the, to your managers or to your, uh, to your team or to the management or whoever it is. But what's important is that right now, there is actually a travel that you're thinking for you to make or for you to, that you have to make that is related to your job. Okay, this week is all about your work. This week is all about your goals, your targets, and your aspirations. And whatever happens, you don't want anybody to get in your way. Okay, whoever it is, regardless. There will be some issues about your mother that you have to deal with. And as much as you want to escape from this, as much as you want to spare me, in a, you know, from your dramas, it's like uh, this is something that you have to deal with because this person or your mother will be creating a big drama in front of everyone. And, you know, obviously, you're the one who's going to come out as the culprit or the, uh, you know, the, the bad person. And this is something that you don't really want to happen because you, you know, your concentration will be fully in your, in your targets and goals this week. And uh, this is just another disturbance or another, you know another thing that you don't want to get in the way and a water sign that's uh th you know that's been lying right in front of you which is you already know that this person has been lying to you all this time and you're just waiting for things to reveal on its own and whatever happens you've already moved on while the two of you are together so it doesn't really affect you anymore and you have learned or master you know to get over the pain or to move on from a particular painful situation that's about to come while you are together because you've been going through the same thing over and over again for the past few relationships and years and you know how it is to take the shortcut or you know how it is to handle the pain so you you're now even more stronger more smarter and more prepared you know for the chaos or for the storm that you will be facing soon now be very careful with the decision that you have to make especially if it's you know pertaining to a uh, government legal documentations, business permits or registrations, or, um, you know, something legal that you have to, something that you have to do. Read all the fine prints, read all the, you know, the contracts, the stipulations and whatever it is, because there might be some gray areas that you might just skip and that you might not be aware, you know, that that is something that you have to realize. But towards the end of the week, finances will be very active okay or it will be coming your way and you are attracting the right energy because the finances that you're so worried about for the past few days or few weeks it is going to come to you it is going to come back to you and you will be more stable than ever okay you will be um it's like preserving the energy you know to deal with a lot of things and to deal with a lot of dramas especially this week and you're also prepared for something to be over, especially if it concerns a relationship. Because you've been feeling this for the past few months or weeks and you're just waiting for things to be final. Okay, you're ready for this. And even though, you know, you've been waiting for changes, of course, when the time has already come and when the time is already there or when the change is already there, it's still going to sting a little bit. But you will live and you will survive. Um, news about money more financial uh, stability um contracts deals negotiations 
Oh, and for some people who's actually thinking of either getting a loan or borrowing from a bank, um, you know, it's not about your qualifications or it's not about the requirements that you have to meet, but it's actually the reason why you want to take a loan or why you want to take a mortgage. I feel like if you just try to look for another way or look for, you know, let's say, for example, option A, option B, option C. Don't just stick around with option A. Try to stick around with option B or C. Okay. And C, you know, if, um, if you will get rejected because, you know, they feel like, ah, oh, that option A is not really good for you. Then think about the option B and option C and C. Because I feel like the, you know, the time or the universe is just trying to pivote you into something better. And not just for the sake that you want to impress some other people, especially your family. Okay? You will always carry the burden of the family or you will always carry the responsibilities of your family. But you also have your own life. Okay? And it's time for you to stick around with it. Alright, let's take a look at your Oracle cards. thinker oh, you're a naturally thinker you overanalyze things poised clean it up time to go observer time for a nap and you know the colors of the uh, the oracle cards it's actually yellow they are a yellow orange it seems like uh, you are about to face you know the sundown and then the sunrise and you know, there will be a brand new beginning for you. Co-create. You tend to overanalyze things and you are thinking about, you know, it's like when there's like some, just one day, the things are not really working out the way you want it to be or there's something that you've been waiting and it, it did not really, you know, came at the right time. You tend to overthink things. You tend to worry, you, you tend to fret and you tend to, you know, create a lot of, uh, you know, a uh, wave. But... You just need to sit still, be patient, and sometimes you just need to wait for things to come and happen in their own way and in their own volition, okay? And you carry your problems the right way. Even though people think that you're so cool and you're okay, you're fine, and you're not really affected with all the challenges that's coming into your life. The people that just don't know you you know, they think that you're good and that you're, you don't really have any worries in life. But those people who's actually very close to you or who knows you so well, knows that you carry the world on your shoulders. And this is because that you carry your problems the right way. You always come up with a solution and you always face your challenges with uh, brevity and with much, uh, you know, strength and smartness. Now, there are also some things in your life that you need to clean up especially the cobwebs of the past and, you know, the lies, the deceptions, the fears, you're also now ready to face your fear as you don't want to deal with any more dramas and with any more fakeness or, you know, fraudulence in your life. And uh, you just want to clean it up or you just want to sweep off some of those people that's been taking advantage of you. And it's time to go. Now, you will be observing how things are going to go this week. And especially that person that's in your life right now that you know that they've been dealing with someone else and they've been up and down, up and down. And, you know, their attitude and their behaviors are very incomparable to, you know, whatever you've had in the past. And you're just fully ready, you know, to whatever that this person is going to bring you. And you also need to catch up some more sleep because you haven't been sleeping and you will be working late, you know, for this week. You also need to learn how to co-create. Or how to be a uh, how to how to team up with someone, or with some people because you you always strive for perfection, and you tend to you know like make your tasks and your responsibilities exclusively for you. You need to learn how to divide things. All right. So anyway, 
that's it for you for this week Capricorn if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live video calls it's already there on my website and um, you know just go and visit me there register for you to access the page at sophieangel.net and pre-recorded vi uh, video readings also available plus get your annual um, personalized forecast for 2019 all right have a great weekend and blessings to you